Construction workers in New Jersey have uncovered a piece of history buried deep beneath the sand. They came across part of a shipwreck. CBS 2's Christine Sloan has the story from Brick, New Jersey. This pile of wood and metal on the sand in the Normandy Beach section of Brick, New Jersey could be from a 19th century shipwreck. The workers discovered the pieces while drilling a steel beam 25 feet into the ground. We broke the head on a machine. They decided to replace the head. They got a second head and it also broke. Dan Lieb, a shipwreck expert, believes these pieces could be from the Ashire ship that wrecked during a fierce storm back in 1850, ironically right in front of a life-saving station, the precursor to the Coast Guard. A key piece of evidence, this barrel-shaped object called a windlass, used on sailing vessels for almost 300 years. That is an object, a device, which is located on the bow of a boat and it's used to raise the anchor or to pull in heavy lines. The ship has historic significance because it was the first time a lifeboat like this with a metal roof and hatch was used to save about 200 people on board who were coming to the New World from England and Ireland. Only one person didn't make it. In the case of a nearshore disaster is you would set up a line between ship and shore and clothesline style, you would run this little metal cart out there, fill it with people, and then bring them back. The Department of Environmental Protection says the wreck could be from any ship or barge. And Leib says because the windlass sits on top, it means there is more beneath the sand. Things like cargo and even gold. For now, they're leaving part of the wreckage here on the sand until the Department of Environmental Protection can come and examine it and to see if there's more down in the sand. In Brick, New Jersey, Christine Sloan, CBS2 News. The DEP will send an archaeologist to look under the sand, but they will continue to, with the steel wall project, working under the site around it until they can determine if the wreck has any historic value and if it should be indeed uprooted.